all the way from Universal Orlando Resort in sunny Florida. It's time for the Family Feud TNA Wrestling Special. And now, here's the star of our show, Mr. Steve Harvey. Welcome to the show, everybody. This is a very, very special show. Welcome to our TNA Wrestling Special, where these wrestlers and knockouts are going to battle it out for bragging rights and $20,000. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> so let's meet our two teams. First of all, it is the wrestlers. Yeah. Uh, VD, my man. Introduce your partners. All right. Got Mr. Anderson. Anderson, the mighty Matt Morgan. Yeah, good answer. Good answer. Mick Foley. Yeah. Good answer. Yeah, that's a good answer. And Jay Lethal. Yeah. Win yourself some money today, fellas. Okay. Let's go meet the knockouts. Hey, Christy. Hello. Nice to meet you. Very nice to meet you. Uh, thank you, God. <laughs> We're excited, right, guys? Right. I've been backstage practicing already. Good answer, good answer. Great answer. And you got the pink on for us. Got the pink on just for you. (laughs) Yeah. It's hot. So introduce everybody, Christy. We have the lovely Velvet Sky. (laughs) Miss Angelina Love. (laughs) The fantastic Lacey Von Eric. (laughs) And Miss Tara. You throw people around pretty tough. This is gonna be good. Hey, good luck to both teams. Let's play few. Give me Christy Ham. Give me RVD. My man. Yay. Okay. A lot, a lot of tension here. Yeah. Okay. Hey, we got the top eight answers on the board, guys. We asked 100 women. Name something men wear that women think is sexy. Wow. Cologne. Cologne. Yeah. One answer can top it, Christy. Briefs. Briefs. <laughs> you control it. You're going to pass the plate. They're going to pass it. Big Mick Foley said pass. It's your turn. Velvet, how you doing? How you doing? Yes, better than ever, really. Hi. I am. (laughs) One of those guys, is one of those guys one of your enemies on the show? All of them. All of them? Oh, yeah. We don't like any of them. Are you kidding me? Look at them. (laughs) Sorry. I'm I'm just being honest. For safety purposes, I think they look absolutely wonderful. (laughs) Don't worry. You're you're under the protection of the knockouts now. We got your back. Okay, the knockouts got got me. Yeah. Thank God for you. All right, we ask 100 women. Name something men wear that women think is sexy. Okay, my answer was actually inspired by you. I'm going to say pink. When they wear pink. (laughs) Oh, come on, women. Come on, women. I got one. I got one. You got one, Angelina? A suit. A suit. Right there. A suit. Lacey, how you doing? I'm doing good. That's right. I'm a little nervous. Um, okay, I'd say tight jeans. Tight jeans. Good answer, Lacey. Tight jeans. <laughs> Tara, how you doing? I'm doing great. Boy, you are dangerous. Is this where we kiss, huh? or is that Rich, my age and myself, Richard Dawson? Yeah, it was we Richard Dawson. Anymore? Yeah, no, I can't oh, do no, that okay, anymore. Your wife will yeah. kind of beat I want me up, to. probably. Yeah, just, no. Yeah. No, she wouldn't beat you up, but she'd fire shots. Yeah. Though, right? <laughs> Hey, so tell me, we ask 100 women, name something men wear that women think is sexy. A uniform. A uniform. Oh, here's the deal. Two strikes. If it's there, okay. you're still alive. If it's not there, the wrestlers can get ready to steal. I'm going to say boxers. Go along boxers. With my other answer. Ah, uh-huh. Velvet. No clothes. Straight. Naked in the nude, nada. Oh. All right, fellas. Here we go. Jewelry, Rob. Jewelry. Jewelry. 
Rob Van Dam, what do you think, man? They ask 100 women, name something me and where that women think is sexy. Mm. I'm gonna go with jewelry. Jewelry! <laughs> jewelry! <laughs> Jumping is good. Jumping is good. <laughs> Number five. <laughs> Tank. <laughs> Number seven. Yeah. What? Okay. <laughs> Number eight. Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> hey, let's move on to question two. Give me Velvet Sky. Give me my man, Mr. Anderson. Top six answers on the board. Name another word for stink. Velvet. S smell. Oh, sorry, sorry. Smell. Smell. Yeah! Wow. Pass or play? Pass. 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 We're going to pass. They're going to pass, Mr. Anderson. All right, pass. Big Matt, DNA. What do you think, man? Name another word for stink. Stank. <laughs> Stank! <laughs> hey, man. Hello. You have no idea. I followed you everywhere. I know your every move. You've been around, you, boy. <laughs> Name another word for stink, Mick. Odor. Odor! Yeah! Jay? How you feeling, man? Pretty good, pretty good. Yourself? Man, pretty athletic, man. A lot of speed in that ring, oh, man. Oh, yeah. Jay, tell me something. Name another word for stink. How about funky? Funky! <laughs> if it's there, you're still alive. If it's not there, the knockouts can get ready to steal. Reek. Reek! You reek! That's a good one. I like that. There you go. You're still alive, Mr. Anderson. If it's there, you stay alive. Stench. Stench. The stench. It got serious. Oh, God. <laughs> Big fella, we got two strikes. If it's there, you're still alive. If not, the knockouts can get ready to steal. <laughs> As Mr. Anderson hints. Scent. Scent. Uh, Here we go. Let's do it. Let's go. Ladies, here we go. Name another word for stink. You can steal right here. Stunk. Stunk. <laughs> the fellas. Let's see number five. Number six. Foul. Yeah. The goal is 300 points, so don't go away. We'll be right back. Wrestling special. We got a good one going, everybody. The wrestlers, 89. The knockout, 64. Give me Angelina Love. Give me Big Matt Morgan. Let's go to work. <laughs> For real, man. I mean, just... Oh, man. <laughs> 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 That's the first time I've ever hosted and, like, been scared of somebody. <laughs> oh, I don't bite. Is you don't it? gotta be scared of me. Okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, everybody, point values are double here. We got the top six answers on the board. Name a place where people are not shy about making out in public. Angelina. A park. A park! <laughs> wow. <laughs> Go past the place. Play. They're gonna play this one, all right. Thank you, God. Hi, Lacey. How you doing? There's no way I could be better. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. I came to work today. Hi. They said we have the TNA knockout ladies here. I said, cool. Okay. Well, what time do I go on? Hey, Lacey, name a place where people are not shy about making out in public. A nudist colony? <laughs> a nudist colony? Oh. Hey, Tyler. Hi. You got it, don't I got you? it. The beach. The Woo! beach. Yeah. 
Give me a place where people are not shy about making out in public. The movies. Yay! The movies. What do you think it is? You say a club, a dance club. At a dance club, making out in the club. <laughs> Y'all didn't pass on this for no reason. Name a place where people are not shy about making out in public. The mall. Whoa. The mall. Oh. We got two strikes, Lacey. Name a place where people are not shy about making out in public. Uh, the, the grocery store. <laughs> Section. You do that all the time? In the freezer section. In the freezer section? Heck, sounds great to me. <laughs> yes, I'd love to go grocery shopping with you, yes. Yes, yes. right now I have my entire marriage on the line, but yes. Excuse me, Marjorie, I'm going grocery shopping with the TNA ladies. We'll be, we'll be in the freezer section. Grocery store. Ah, we go, fellas. Rob Van Dam, what do y'all think? Here's your chance to steal. It's a tight game. Name a place where people are not shy about making out in public. Uh, Yeah, I'm gonna go with uh, Lover's Lane. Tunnel of Love. Give it to me. Lover's Lane, Tunnel of Love. Knockout 64. Steal anybody's game, though. We'll be right back. Don't go away. The Wrestler 251. The Knockout 64. Give me Lacey Vaughn, Eric, and my man Mick Foley. Oh. Steve, am I allowed to ask my opponent a question here? Yeah, you can. Sure, you can. Um, you want to go grocery shopping in your job? <laughs> <sighs> Point values are triple, guys. Top four <laughs> answers are on the board. Name something an inconsiderate person will hog from others. Lacey. Ice cream. Ice cream. <laughs> Pass or play? We'll play. Okay. Okay, they're gonna play. This. <laughs> Ladies, this is it. Name something an inconsiderate person will hog from others. The restroom? The restroom. <laughs> Christy, no strikes. Money. Money. Oh. Only one strike. Velvet, what do you think it is? Um, Give me something an inconsiderate person will hog from others. Loyalty. <laughs> I loyalty. Don't know. I don't know. Uh, sorry, sorry. That's okay. Well, we're down to it, Angelina. You got two strikes. If it's not there, the fellas gets a chance to steal and win. The bed sheets. Oh! The bed sheets! Wow. 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 Yes, come on, Lacey. Lacey? Okay, I'm gonna say close. If it's there, Rob Van Dam, you steal, you win. Name something an inconsiderate person will hog from others. We know what it is, Steve. It's a TV remote. Wow. That sounds, I don't know, but let's go. Looking for the TV remote for the win. (laughs) Two players for fast money. Let's go, fellas. Need you up here. Let's go. I got him right here. I got Mr. Anderson. I got Rob Van Dam. Let's go get this money. Hey, welcome back to Family Feud's TNA Wrestling Special. The wrestlers won the game, and it's time to play. Yeah. 
before we get started, we're out here somebody would like to wish you luck. Hey guys, it's SoCal Val from TNA Wrestling, wishing everyone on the team's good luck in fast money. Big time! Okay, here we go. RVD, I'm gonna ask you five questions in 20 seconds. Try to give me the most popular answer. If you can't think of something, just say pass, and if we have enough time, we'll get back to it. And then if you and your boy, Mr. Anderson, put it together and come up with 200 points, look in that camera, tell everybody what you're gonna win. 20,000 big ones. Yeah! Big ones, baby, yeah! 20 seconds on the clock, please. The clock will start after I read the first question. Name someone you'd be shocked to receive a naughty text message from. Mom. Name an insect you hope never gets inside your ear. Spider. Besides water, name something used to put out a fire. CO2. Tell me the age when a girl should be allowed to start wearing makeup. 14. Name something some men wear and some men don't. <laughs> right, let's go. You play well, though. Let's go. Let's see what we got. I said, name someone you'd be shocked to receive a naughty text message from. You said, Mom. That would pretty much blow me back, too. <laughs> Survey said. That's a good one, man. I said, name an insect you hope never gets inside your ear. You said. Spider. Survey said. Wow. I said, besides water, name something used to put out a fire. You said. CO2, survey said. Aww. They didn't see it that way. Tell me the age when a girl should be allowed to start wearing makeup. You said 14, survey said. That's a good one. We didn't get to this one. Name something some men wear and some men don't. You said nothing. That's a good one. We got 60 other right work for you, man. Way to go, Mr. Anderson, let's go. Mr. Anderson, <laughs> we got your work cut out for you, man. Yeah? RVD put up 60. You need 140. All right. I'm going to ask you the same five questions. You cannot duplicate the answers. If you do, you're going to hear this sound. <laughs> I'm going to say try again. You give me another answer. 10-4. Going to be a little tougher this time, so we're going to give you 25 seconds. You ready? What? All right, let's remind everybody of RVD's answers. 25 seconds on the clock, please. All right, here we go. Clock will start after I read the first question. Simple. Name someone you'd be shocked to receive a naughty text message from. My grandmother. Name an insect you hope never gets inside your ear. An earwig. Besides water, name something used to put out a fire. A uh, fire extinguisher. Tell me the age when a girl should be allowed to start wearing makeup. 15. Name something some men wear and some men don't. Cologne. Let's go, man. I said, name someone you'd be shocked to receive a naughty message from. You said, your grandmama. Grandmama, what are you doing? <laughs> My grandmama is tripping. <laughs> Survey said. Oh. That was a great answer, man. Number one answer was mom. RVD gave it. Wow. Name an insect you hope never gets inside your ear. You said. I don't, I don't. It was on Star Trek too. Hey, I think it's, <laughs> Mr. Anderson. I think it's a great answer. <laughs> Earwig. I've never heard of that. The number one answer was B, wasp. Wow. Besides water, name something used to put out a fire. You said? Fire extinguisher, survey said. Fire extinguisher was the number one answer. I said, tell me the age when a girl should be allowed to start wearing makeup. You said? 15, survey said. Wow. 15 was the number one answer. I said, name something some men wear and some men don't. You said? Cologne. Survey said. <laughs> Underwear was the number one answer. That's a good shot, fella. Next time, TNA wrestlers versus the knockout on the Family Feud. And don't forget, everybody, play Family Feud on Facebook with your friends. I'm Steve Harvey. We'll see you next time.